Crocodile slot. Ah! Coming down. Come to say hello. Just making a move on my girlfriend. Gotta watch out for this guy. Yeah, I'm not caught up for this. <laughs> Baby, you okay? Hola! Hola! Como estas? How are you? Very good. Very good? How are you? Mm, yeah, yeah, pretty good. The sun's out. It's mm -hmm. been raining all morning. Yes. And the sun has finally come out. It's looking spectacular out there. Mm. Tell me, what are we doing today? Today we are hopefully, 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 finally going to see some clocks. Yes, it's been a long time. We've been here now in Boca, it's almost probably three <laughs> weeks. And we are yet to see the famous sloth. Yeah. Um, Our friends are just texting us some photos and like, yeah, we saw one with a baby, yeah, they were one meter away, and we're like, this is just not classic. true. It's just stitch they're up. Just, they're, just... they're a myth. Yes. Right? Um, we have found the best spot around to find them, and there's apparently meant to be some snakes in there as well. Yeah, Possibly a crocodile or two. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. We're going to go find out. We're just going to take the dinghy through some mangroves. Um, it's meant to be really beautiful and really cool. Looking forward uh, to it? I'm really looking forward to it. Right now we are in Starfish, a bay, what, four or five nautical miles from Bucket? 6.4. 6.4. There you go. Um, yeah, we got here yesterday and we're chilling with some friends and now we're gonna see the nature. Let's do it. Ooh. You like my salsa? I love your salsa. I don't, I don't know salsa. There is a uh, salsa club in Bocas Town, but it's closed because of COVID, so otherwise we would have the salsa game on. Mmm. Nacho chips and salsa, you're making me hungry. <laughs> oh. What? Out here in the wilderness, the sloth hunter has come from Australia to find the beautiful sloth. But he's not going to hunt it, no, he's just going to capture it on this camera. That's not going in. <laughs> Lucky for me, you, I am the they, editor! They call me, uh, Sloth Dundee. Sloth Dundee. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me, Isabel, how do you say sloth in Spanish? I don't remember. My friend Camilla told me. El soso, perasosos. Say again? Something perasosos. <laughs> Isabel has been trying to work out what sloth is. In Spanish for like the last 10 minutes. You're getting frustrated, aren't you, babe? Yes. Just like, what is it? Okay, let's let's start firing. See anything, babe? Not yet. A few birds. Mm. No perasosos? I actually had to Google it, but I was right. It's called perasosos. 
perasosos or perasosos. I'm not even depending. Gonna try. I'm not even going to try. Depending where you're from or what country you're from. Uh, please correct me if I'm wrong, but I think that's what my friend said. Um, quite happy with myself there, I remember. <laughs> I got my gondolier just here. This is incredible, isn't it? What's the gondolier song? That's it. We just met some locals then and he said there would definitely be slots here. And some monkeys, snakes. Yeah. So he said definitely, so definitely, definitely. So Isabel's got her hopes up, just a little bit. Yes. <laughs> He's just chilling there, isn't he? He's scared of the snake. I don't do snakes. <laughs> no? Mm. You're from Australia. I don't do snakes. <laughs> Baby. <laughs> So beautiful. There's so many of them. Oh, there's a baby. <gasps> that is unreal. That is so cool. Oh wow. It's so cute. It's coming to check us out. Oh my goodness. It's like, hello. You see it? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Mum's like, hey, don't go too far down there. He's coming closer. <laughs> Mum's mom, got his tail. <laughs> Just to say hello. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's an easy gesture, buddy. Oh. Oh. He had some bad leaf this morning. <laughs> that, was, that was pretty, pretty cool. Pretty special. Pretty special. They're still jumping on behind you. Monkeys in the wild, just down the road from our boat. That has not happened, I think that's a first for us. The, um, the monkeys that we hanged around for like 20 minutes are actually following us now. Oh, yes. I had my doubts we'd actually see any monkeys. They're so cute. And we saw like a mega family. <laughs> Make a mega family. They're like brothers or and ten. sisters and uncles, aunties. Write in the comment be comments below. Probably something I could just Google. But what do you call a baby monkey? Do you just call it a baby because it's like so closely related to us? I reckon. Or has it got like a name? Like a baby horse is a foal. A baby cow is a calf. Does a baby monkey have its own? Crocodile slut the hey? What? That's what you just named yourself just an hour ago. Do you remember? What did I name myself? Crocodile slut. Ah! Go back. She's eating a leaf. We need to go back. I'm Take going. me back. I'm going. Reverse. Oh, she's so cute. I can't deal. Incredible! Hi! Aren't 
Aren't you the cutest? Mm. Yeah, very good climbers, you know why. Just making a move on my girlfriend. <laughs> Gotta watch out for this guy. Okay, he's less than, what, a meter away? One and a half meters away from Yeah. Him. And we've seen him climb from way over there to like here. <laughs> no. Oh my god. Those, those claws could puncture our tender. <laughs> Not careful. be part of the silly Mayweather crew. Oh, sorry mate. Those claws would puncture our tender in an instant. But he's like, why, but why? Why? <laughs> oh I know. I want oh, you to be a part of our crew as well. Oh my god. He doesn't look real. He kinda no. looks like a robot. He's not hanging there, like, what about me? What about me? Why can't I come? <laughs> that was unreal. Never in my wildest dreams did I think one would actually approach us and get so close. Good morning guys, uh, this morning uh, we have just woken up as you can probably tell and it's a bit of a sad morning, uh, a sailing vessel that we have sailed with for uh, a long time. We met them in December of 2019 and it's now March of 2021. So we've been sailing with them for quite a while and we've crossed, this is our 10th country together isn't it is? This is our 10th country together um, and they have been like our family. So today they are leaving. Um, they got accepted into French Polynesia and we have not. So the chances are is they will sail away and we will not be able to catch them up, unfortunately. Their vessel name is Wild Thing 3. Um, it's Steve, Chris, uh, the parents and um, Mace, Roman and Noah are the three boys. Uh, we've had so many adventures with these guys. We got locked down in SVG with these guys. It's hard to explain because for a cruising vessel, you don't generally stay too long with another cruising vessel because you're always moving. You always got your own plans. And so it's uh, we've, we've developed a very, very special bond with these guys. Um, they are legends. So we're gonna go say goodbye to them this morning and hopefully I get a little bit on film for you guys. See ya. Oh, it's that good. Yeah, we'll see you in French. Bye. Yeah, we'll see you again. We'll stay in touch. Yeah, I see ya. It's not good boy. See, see you soon. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm really, I really hate goodbyes. <laughs> it's not a goodbye, but still, 
these guys have been like our family, you know? And uh, yeah, it's sad. Isabel didn't want to film anything, <laughs> and now I kind of talked her into it. And it's uh, it's hard for us. Yeah. It's okay. I'll see them again. Yeah. Yeah. Going close to French, French Polo open up. Yeah. And we'll catch them up. Or New Zealand, whatever. A New Zealand family. Baby, more friends, more friends are leaving. Baby, you okay? So these are our second friends that we're saying goodbye to. Makushla we've been sailing with for six months. We were locked down with them in SVG with a lot of other boats. Uh, but it's just uh, sad to see them go because we don't know we don't know if we're going to catch them up or not, so, but, uh, fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Yeah. Is that pink? Yeah, that's my mum's phone. Base, you want to be in the vlog? Yeah. Tell us about your, what, what's going on here? Um, we're doing a barbecue for Kyle's birthday. How old's Kyle turning? Um, 37. Oh! <laughs> Get the tongue out, get the tongue out, get the tongue out. Say it. Today we are going surfing. Isabel's been practicing her surfing and today she feels confident enough to be filmed. Yeah, killing it. Just the sun's not here. Yeah, yeah, killing it, bro, yeah. bro, 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 bro. Woo! Fully sick, fully yeah. sick surfers.